Uh, 3-0 win over Coast Stompy. Congratulations. What was it like out there? Very hot. It was a lot hotter than uh, other years, and uh, I was wiping my hand on my trousers a lot, and uh, I felt a bit uncomfortable at the start. But once I got used to that, I felt a little bit better, but I did not play on that stage as well as I was in practice. I was, I was f really, really furious with myself. And I thought, get chances, take these sets out, because otherwise you're going home. I mean, there was a break of throw to lead 2-1 in the second set. That was probably the decisive uh, 60 checkout in, in the game. Was, were you thinking, you know, this, this is the turning point? Well, there's one thing I've worked on more than anything else in the last nine months, and that's that shot, which is uh, hitting a single 20 and hitting double top, because I've been involved in two World Cups now where I've had 56 and I've hit 16 and missed tops and missed 10s. And it haunts my dreams, it really does, because when you've got two darts for tops and 10s, a professional dart player should hit that. It really should, you know, 99 times out of 100. And the hard work has paid off because it gave me the opportunity to win sets and well, gave me the opportunity to win the match. Didn't hit uh, any 180s in the game. Is that a little bit of a concern for you? No. I'd rather hit doubles. Um, I've never really been notified as a, as a 180 hitter. Um, I remember a game back in 2010 where I hit five 180s in an 11 leg match and didn't win the match I'd much rather hit doubles I really would and of course you face Robert Thornton now in the second round just before Christmas you've never met in a major competition you've met in, in you know, the Players Championship etc but is it going to be a different mentality for you playing up on that stage in the second round I think the game with Robert next week will be very respectful there won't be a lot of big celebrations. It'll be a real honest game. You know, Robert and I go way back. Um, you know, the amount of respect that I've got for that guy just is immeasurable. Um, when he won the UK Open back in June, uh, I think I was one of the first people to tweet him and you know, and send him a text and say, you know, I'm so proud of you because nobody's gone through. And you know, when I won the Players Championship, he was the same with me. He texted me and he said, you know, I'm really proud of you. So. The best player will win next week. There's no doubt about that. There's no get-out clauses or anything like that. And I'm just really looking forward to the tussle because if I'm going to win that game, I'm going to have to really hard in the next week because at the moment, he's the better player. Well, we wish you well for that. Thank you for coming to talk to us. Cheers.